family, Jenny, the rest of y'all, listen up. I'm showing you right now some dried up herb. It is my cinnamon basil. And I dried it. I just placed it in a container and let the leaves dry and then crumbled it. I haven't put it in the blender to blend it up, but it's dried. And I did put some in some of my veggie chili that I made today that I'm going to share with you in a few minutes, Jenny. Wish you were here to eat some of this veggie chili with me because I put all kind of spices and herbs and stuff in there. But I also added some of this cinnamon basil in there, too. It's very delicious. And it has a very fruity smell. It's not so much a cinnamon smell, but to me it's like a, it's the cinnamon it, it, um, scent is there, but it's off by the fruity smell. So I really like this cinnamon basil, and I'm glad I dried it so I can use it in some of my other meals that I'm going to be preparing. But anyway, I just wanted to share this. Now I'm going to share with you my plate of spaghetti with I, um, my um, veggie noodles that I topped with my vegetable chili. Be back. Okay, Janice, I'm sharing this with you because you are the one I do the most talking with about our meals, about eating healthier. And um, I just want to share with you, I made this homemade veggie chili with carrots, tomatoes, and celery, and a whole bunch of spices and herbs. I even put, like I said, the cinnamon basil. Nutmeg. And ginger. I guess I put the turmeric. And I also got lots of different kinds of chili powders and stuff in here. The flavor is that of chili. Yes, it's just meatless. It's just vegetable chili, which is very delicious. And I smothered it on top of these um, veggie noodles, which I made from squash. And I spiralized them in a size like a thin spaghetti. And I'm about to tear all this up because that last chili spaghetti meal was so good. Oh, and I also put some of my homemade applesauce in here instead of brown sugar to get rid of that bitterness. I, I put some of my homemade applesauce in here. So it's a lot going on in this chili, but it's mighty delicious. And I'm about to eat all this up. And, um, just wanted to share that. Also, let me see. I did chop up about a quarter cup of mushrooms in here too. So the mushrooms, I got to add that to one of my eliminations to see if I'm not going to get any heartburn or nothing from mushrooms. So here we go. I'm about to tear down up on this spaghetti, veggie, chili, spaghetti. All right, Jen. Talk to you later. Thanks for watching.